that was the way I relayed that to our, uh, the guys in the locker room. And they all know, I mean, look at these gray hairs, look at my face. Um, I look a lot older since I started coaching this year. And they joke about how old I am. And I said, take this into context, guys. We, I, I, I wasn't alive last time we shared a conference. Um, and then, that, then it really hit home to these guys. That's, that was a long time. Um, yeah, I, I can't even express how excited I am and proud of these guys. Um, how hard we've worked um, to get to this point. But I think with our crowd, I mean, you saw it. There's a lot of, there's 40 years of pent up uh, basketball excitement that just came out tonight. And I think our guys express that on the court with their energy. I don't know, I just love when beating them on their own court and then going home, just happy. Had to get them back, you know. Uh, they took it from us in football and uh, we just got to get them back. And uh, it was really great to get the dub. I think it was a little bit of both. They're a great team. They, they got length that, that gives everybody problems. They've got great ball handlers. Um, their kids stepped up and made the shots when they needed to make them. They, they had a great game plan. They, they forced Coco to, to shoot outside perimeter shots. They took away his penetration to kind of give us fits. When we don't make shots and we can't get into our type of offense or our defense and when we're full court pressing and get into the transition and making things happen, you know, we've got to find something else. And uh, they did a great job. They have length. They didn't go for our head fakes. They stayed on the grounds, contested shots, and made it difficult. Trev just has like he just hits shots when you need them, and that's that's just great. So I don't know, and then I'm just kind of I guess I'm that loose guy who's just always moving. I guess so that helps out the team.